draw my story, Water Names. Water Names was written by Lan Samantha Chang at the end of the novella Hunger as a short story. Lan Samantha Chang was born in Appleton, Wisconsin in 1965. She spoke only Chinese and she learned English throughout her schooling. She moved to the U.S. after the Japanese invasion and she studied at Yale University and the University of Iowa. And she experienced the typical Chinese American immigrant experience. Twelve hundred years ago, the civilized parts of China lay north of the Yangtze River. The Yangtze River was a grand, broad river that ran for four thousand miles. In those days, there lived a fisherman named Wen Jingging, who trained cormorants, which were sleek black birds with long bending necks, to go into the water and catch fish. Wen had a beautiful daughter who loved the river. To this woman, the river was as familiar as the sky. One day, as she sent a cormorant into the water, she said, if only this catch would bring back something more than another fish. She looked down into the water and the spirit of a young man who had drowned in the river many years before saw her lovely face. After a long while, the cormorant emerged from beneath the waters with a large fish. When Wen gutted the fish, he discovered a valuable pearl ring. The girl became convinced that there's a kingdom under the water, and the prince is asking me to marry him. She told her father this, and he said, nonsense, and forbade her from sitting near the water. For a year, things were normal, until a terrible flood wiped out almost everything. She had taken advantage of the confusion to hurry to the river and visit her beloved. The family never found her. They say she was seduced by a water ghost. Or perhaps she lost her mind to desiring 